Hey friends, happy Labor Day. I hope you've had a relaxing long weekend. We sure have, and I am so excited to share some things with you. I actually started working on these items back in July, so I would have them ready for fall, and technically it's not fall, but as everyone on Facebook has been pointing out, the burr months have started. So I think it's okay to go ahead and share some fall and get a jump start on it. So here's some things. We're gonna start with some decorative items first. Thinking about Halloween coming around the corner, I have this really cute little floral pumpkin that could hang up um, in your classroom or your office or your home. It's already got a ribbon, it just needs a little hook and you are good to go. I think it is so pretty. And these are $10. The next thing I've got are two uh, pillows and the pillows are 20. The pillows are so pretty. So this one, it's full of pumpkins, all different pumpkins. And honestly, the color in here is not, the lighting is not the greatest. Uh, the colors are definitely more vivid. If you could see it in person, it looks a little washed out on the screen, but it's the best I could do. And then I love this one. This one's great for fall and Halloween. It's a little wreath and it's got some little spooky um, spiders coming down and some little flies landing around. So beautiful, but a little bit spooky for Halloween too. So I love these. These are 20 each and this little guy is 10. Now, getting ready for trick or treat. I have some trick or treat bags. Trick or treat bags are $10 each. Look how cute these are. And I'll tell you that they are great and they last. Hunter still, uh, well, he doesn't use it, but Sadie still carries hunters that I made for him when he was five. He's 20, so that thing's been toting candy around for 15 Halloweens. Um, so I wanna show you some different patterns that I have. And these are 10 each. They're nice and big. They'll hold lots of candy. They're also great for bags, just for going to the farmer's market. They're great for um, carrying books, but these specifically have a little Halloween look to them. So we've got our little skeleton dogs there, a little purple accent. And then these have the Day of the Dead pattern. Love that, and they're all lined on the inside as well. These have got bats, bats on them. I love this one, I love the bats with the purple straps. And then, if you just would like to have a fall bag to take to the farmer's market or to carry your books when you're carrying things around, I have these two that are gorgeous and they're fall colors, but they're not Halloween-y. So this would be great for grown-ups that just would like to have a new fall tote. And I have been taking mine to the farmer's market on Saturday morning, and you can see how big they are, and I load them up full of goodies. They are fabulous. So if you would like a fall bag or a trick-or-treat bag special, no one else will have a bag like this, you let me know. All right, journals, my favorite. I love, love, love journals. Been very busy making journals. So one thing that I love to do when I get bored or it's a rainy day, I grab my basket full of scraps and I start sewing them together and I start making patchwork. So this first one here is so cute. It's full of just different um, colors, a fabric for fall. As you can see, there's some of the bag that was left over that slipped in there. And then it's pretty with the yellow and uh, the aqua on the inside. Okay, we got that one. This one actually is left over from summer. It didn't get snagged. It's pretty in pink. I love this one with the green ribbon. It has the double ribbon look to it. And then it has the green and pink on the inside. These two uh, are, the fabric was patchy. I didn't actually sew the patches together. It just come with this gorgeous fabric with these patches for fall. I love, 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 love. This one's got the brown ribbon. This one's got the white ribbon. Let's check out the insides. The brown one is yellow and green on the inside. And the white ribbon is yellow and it has, it matches the outside. Okay, so we've got those. And then these are gorgeous. These are also a fabric that already had the patchwork look to it. I absolutely love these. 
I think they look kind of denim, plus they've got the red, white, and blue. Love, love, love. Let's check these out on the inside too. Get it open. Okay, we've got a kind of a brown on the inside and then the inside flap matches the outside. This one's probably the same way because I made all these together. Journals are $10. How gorgeous. So let's just do a quick recap. We have gorgeous fall journals, uh, graduates, people going off to college, meetings at school, your kiddo's teacher, your best friend that loves to write, or your own personal journal. Take it to church, make it your prayer journal, write your sermon notes in it, and your, your uh, just anything you need, your to-do list. I have these journals all over the place, and I absolutely love them. And they are just your basic standard size. So once it's done, you can pop a journal right out and put it on a new journal if you wanted to, because just they'll just uh, go to any regular size notebook. So we've got the red, white, and blue patchwork. We've got the, what do we want to call this? Yellow, green, orange, blue patchwork, summer pink, and this crazy, wonderful, Halloween-y looking patchwork. These are $10. Our beautiful fall pillows are 20 and a lot of love and work went into these. I'm gonna tell you, especially this one, I worked on this one for weeks and weeks to get all those little stitches, all those little stitches and all those little pumpkins. It was a lot of work. And this guy is just too cute. I love him. So $10 for him. If you see anything you like, let me know. We'll get together and please share this video because I love you guys and you buy my stuff, but sometimes we need to get out there to other people. So if you would share, that would just mean the world to me. All right. You guys have a blessed, blessed, blessed week. I love you, love you, love you. Bye-bye.